What's up guys, before I get started on this avatar, this is Mickey Mouse for Black Ops 2. Uh, I want to go over something real quick. Um, if you can't follow, and this is not to offend anybody, but if you can't follow instructions and visuals, then go ahead and go to another video. Um, I'm getting people that are pissed, they want me to destroy what I've already created and go back in and redo it over and over again. I'm not going to do that. So if you're looking for someone who's going to come in and destroy what they've made and try to re-put it all back together, I won't do that. I'm showing you how to do it step by step. You'll have to visually have a sense of understanding of how to maneuver and manipulate these items, these layers. Um, and let me go ahead and pick up from there. Let's get this started. So um, keep all negative comments and stuff out. Uh, like I said, I don't care to... Uh, give help but you know I, I'm doing this for straight you know just trying to help you guys get the, the get the emblems that you all want okay so let's go from there uh, the first emblem here is um, it is the rounded square white which is the background and you can see it in the background uh, square two remember you may have to pause this uh, windsock um, I used it and made it into his body and you can see on the bottom there how I made it into his body and again pause as much as you need to uh, layer 3 I used a quarter circle pretty simple black layer 4 is the outline of his whole head which was a circle and I'm trying to flip through it as fast as I can here sorry about that and like I said, you may have to pause. Um, layer five, half circle black. That was to get the upper black on his head. Okay. Layer six, full circle, and layer seven, full circle, which are the ears. Okay, position them appropriately. It's kind of important to the Mickey Mouse character. Layer eight, full circle. Layer nine is full circle. And you can see how I use those right here to cut into the black to give him um, the eyebrow raising separation of the skin tone and his mouse head. <laughs> okay, layer 10, full circle, black. It's the outline from layer 11, which is the eye, which basically you can copy and move them around. However, it doesn't matter which way you put these it's just about sizing is important again um, use your own judgment pause when you need to okay same thing here full circle on 12 full circle, no, full circle on 13 um, basically um, same thing just resize it make it a little smaller than the right eye the left eye smaller now this is the pupils and it was a full circle that's been skewed for both 15, or 14 and 15. And I only made the left one slightly smaller. You can see the positioning. Layer 16 is the oven mitt. And I had to sketch and skew it around just a little bit to give his nose that rounded edge. Okay. Now layer 17, oven mitt again. I'm sorry I'm on layer 18 I'm sorry layer 18 is a full circle and I had to skew it a little bit to get his cheek and you can see how that fit into place there that's layer 18 layer 19 is an oven mitt and I had to skew it around to get it to get the roundness on his nose and you have to mess around with that one that one was kind of tricky it took a little while but I finally figured it out layer 20 is oven mitt again I just flipped it around, rotated it, skewed it down to give the bottom part of his nose. Layer 21 is the cone. I used it for his lower jaw that extends from his his mouth from the lower part of his tongue. You can kind of see the gap there. Okay. Layer 22 is the golf flag. I used it for his for his mouth, his upper part of his mouth. And that is the black and that's the outline I used it as an outline okay layer 23 was the kiss 
I used it for the inside corner of his mouth to give it that rounded edge. Okay, I'm going to flip through this. Remember, pause when you need to. Layer 24 is the rock shadow. I used it for the left hand front side of his mouth. That is black as well. Layer 25 is the golf flag. That is back with layer 22. Um, all I did was put down layer 20, 22, or 25 first. Put down layer 25 first, come back and put 22 behind your 25. Drag it down and shrink it just slightly and it'll give you the contour of his upper lip. You can see how that will work. Okay. Layer 26 is bone. I used it for his cheek, this smile. You can kind of see the indention that it created. I had to skew it down to make that. Layer 27 is his tongue. I used a full circle. I used a flesh, a flesh tone tongue, and I used a full circle and I skewed it around for layer 28 as well. So you can kind of see both of these here. Remember, pause, go back, whatever you need to do. And if you get frustrated, just save what you got, come back to it another day, and try it again because you can save in the emblem editor on Black Ops 2. Okay, for layer 29, you've got the bone, it's black. I used it to give his tongue the split. You can see the split there. For layer 30, is the quarter circle, black. I used it to give some separation from the nose and the left eye. For layer 31, I used the thimble. I skewed it around and made it his pants, or rather I called them his high water pants. Okay, and for layer 32, I used a full circle, sketched it, and skewed it around to make a button for his pants. Again, it takes a while for me to make these. I appreciate all your patience. If this helps you guys to create this, then I hope that it works out for you. I hope that I didn't go through this too quickly. If not, please feel free to go back, rewind, uh, pause, do whatever you need to do to make your Mickey Mouse. And again, this has been the Mad Review. I appreciate any subscriptions. Please rate, comment, and subscribe. And if you don't got nothing nice to say, then don't say nothing. I mean, that's something as simple as, as that. If you don't have the skill enough to kind of sit down and put all these pieces together, then why are you on here bashing people? People do this to be nice to the community. That's why I'm doing it. So please, again, rate, comment, subscribe. Um, I will be doing more emblems as time goes on. Uh, I appreciate all the support I'm getting from the community. I appreciate it. Guys, this has been the Mad Review. Till next time.